guys, Alex Carrier going over tomorrow's workout. Here's going to show you guys our warm up. We're going to do five body complexes to start. So we're going to do the body weight squat. Uh, we're going to do so. We're going to do a tuck jump first. My bad. And then a body weight squat. And then a push up. I always get the first part wrong. And then roll over into a sit up. Roll over into a Superman. We do five of those. So five circuits of that. On our hands and knees, do a wrist stretch. So fingers pointing towards our body, you need to work our wrists out pretty good for these hang squat cleans today. Carrie's gonna go with her fingers pointed out to the side, rocking back and forth, and then pulsing lightly on your forehand. Deep lunge stretch next. So try and drop your elbows down, push that knee as far forward out as possible. We'll do each side twice, hold only for a couple seconds. Half pigeon after that. So crossing one leg in front of the other, that shin should be as perpendicular to our body as possible. Uh, hold that for a few seconds, do both sides twice. We get into a little bit more hip stuff um, next. So we're gonna do a 90-90 seated rotation. Um, notice Carrie's knees are at a 90 degree angle. She's gonna rock over the other side. If it's really hard for you, you can have your hands on the ground and just kind of move until you find good comfort. We're gonna do that for about 30 seconds. Hop up, gorilla squats. So. Uh, body weight squat, we're going to grab onto our toes, dri driving those knees out, do a full deep squat, we're going to raise one arm up, look past your hand, and do both sides, do a few on each side. Uh, barbell and dumbbell warm up next, so we do some front squats, and then work on a hang squat clean. So we'll open up with just three front squats, getting our legs warmed up, okay? We'll then do a burger warm up, so going from mid shin, we're going to do a lift off, and do a shrug for a few reps, actually from hang, hang position, so, so above knee. So I'm gonna do, do a few shrugs, a few pulls, and we'll just go and do a few hang squat cleans. Pitching in that full deep squat. We'll then transition to some overhead squats. So three overhead squats, so super wide grip overhead. Okay, knees are out, abs are really tight. Into that deep squat, keeping that chest up and that bars over our body's center of balance. So essentially from side view, it's over midfoot. Hang squat snatch, Bergner next. So we'll go from our hang position and work on that drive and shrug, drive and pull, and then hit some hang squat snatches. So super good in-depth warm up. Our strength today, hang squat cleans. We're doing, um, we're in week six, we're finding our max. So following the rep scheme from 50% up to 100, uh, we're trying to establish a new hang clean. <laughs> hang clean squat. So main position, we're pulling through our hips, we're driving as hard as we can, good shrug, good pull, catching in that full squat. So um, hit that hard for at home stuff, we're gonna do um, one and a half dumbbell curls. So do a full rep and a half rep. So halfway up. Uh, eight and then uh, some dumbbell squats. So loading that dumbbell on your shoulder, on your back, or, or on your front rack, whatever you got. Some squats, getting our lower body prepped. We're gonna end with um, three to five sets, five dumbbell hang squat things. So just swinging through our hips, pulling through. If you have two dumbbells, great, go for it. Uh, otherwise, just uh, some single arm, get a few reps per side. That's our at home stuff. So, why today? It's called, yeah, okay. Uh, it's pretty tough, it, it should be hard. Um, definitely start with smart weights. Uh, I'll walk you guys through it here. Carrie will show you guys the movements. We're gonna do uh, two rounds to start of 10 power snatches. Again, this weight should be lighter than most RX wad weights. After your 10 power snatches, 10 overhead squats and then three pull-ups, two rounds. Next, complete two rounds of 10 squat snatches. So bars on the ground, pulling through our hips, all the way into a squat, 10 of those, 10 box jump overs, and then three pull-ups again. So up and over the box, you can clear it if you guys want. Next, two rounds uh, of 10 power cleans, 10 front squats, and then three more pull-ups. So two rounds of that. Power cleans, pulling up to our chest, not squatting. So we get 10 of those, 10 front squats, three pull-ups. 
Next is gonna be two rounds of 10 squat cleans. So from the ground, you're pulling through your hips into a full squat, just like you did in the strength. You're going from the ground, 10 box jump overs, three pull-ups. You guys get through all of that. So what I didn't talk about is the weight's going up every section. So it's progressive, lighter, heavier, heavier, heavier. If you get through all of that, you're doing even heavier weight, max clean and jerks. So say you have a minute left, you guys get as many clean and jerks. So power clean and then jerking that weight overhead as possible. Woo! So if you guys uh, have a blast with it, if you guys are at home doing dumbbell stuff, uh, grab a dumbbell for those movements, bent over row for the pull-ups like we've been doing. Uh, have a blast. Uh, hit it hard. Uh, okay. Oh yeah, okay. Uh, classes haven't been, been completely full. We got room, let's get you guys in here. We, we can get a full gym, let's do it. Love you guys. Bye guys, love you.